all you got to do is call. Reunited, and it feels so good. I don't even know where to begin. Adrian Bailone and Tamara Mowry Housley came together face to face for the first time in a year. On Wednesday, Adrian shared a series of photos on vacation in upstate New York, where she had the chance to reconnect with her old pal and former co host of The Real, posting this emotional video. You got a friend. Tamara also posted a photo of the two with the caption writing, My forever girl crush. Proud of you, A. Eh? It was a year too long since I've seen your gorgeous face. It was just like we left off. You will forever have my heart. I love, love, love you always. And their reunion didn't stop there. The two spent the day at the Inn at Pound Ridge, relaxing, enjoying cocktails, and taking in the view. Their reunion comes after Tamara's decision to leave The Real last year to move to Napa with her family. In September, Adrian told ET how she felt about her leaving the show. So when Tamara decides, you know, that she's no longer gonna be a part of the show, what's that process like? Like saying goodbye to her? I think naturally it's bittersweet. We're like, yeah. man, we we love having you. But at the same time, when you're genuinely someone's friend, you know what makes them happy. And I know that being with her children and being in Napa with her husband and running their business there and all the other opportunities that, and the dreams that she still wants to fulfill. As a friend, we're like, girl, yes, like you got this. We know that this next journey, the next steps that she's gonna take are gonna be phenomenal. And we're excited to see those happen, those dreams come true for her. So again, we're like, damn, we gonna miss you, Tam, that rhymed. But <laughs> we're also just so proud of her and so happy for her in real life. And as for Tamara, she told ET last year how she's settling with her new life in Napa and why the move was best for her family. You came into our living rooms every day for seven years, but now you're full time living in Napa working on your your vineyard and this amazing family that you've created what is life oh, like for you now in this next chapter there's one word i can think of and it's peace i have peace i have peace because i'm with my family and my family rejuvenates me being around and i i am so grateful and i i am so blessed that i am able to say those words i realize that it doesn't mean we don't have stressful days. It doesn't mean that there aren't days where I just want to like, you know, scream, sure. right? It's, it's, that's normal. But I love my family. And, you know, people have seen me talk about that for seven years. It's true. <laughs> so being around my family, being there for my children, they're at an age right now where they want mommy around. You know, I like, I'm a hands-on parent. I know. I like, you know, to to help them, whether it's in, you know, soccer, dance, obviously it's pre-COVID, um, but we still do those things at home with school, with, with homework. And we started, you know, my husband has had the winery for years with his family, but we are now in control over it. It's pretty awesome when your father-in-law is like, here, you want this? And you're like, what? But Tamara also made it clear she's not done with her TV career just yet. What does the next five to 10 years look like for you? Is it acting? Is it posting? Is it wine? Is it being a full-time mom and maybe putting the other stuff on the back burner? You, you actually said everything that I want to do <laughs> in the next five, 10 years. I loved doing my talk show. I, I, you know, it was, it was great. It was, it, I did it for seven years. I built an amazing family. I learned a lot about myself, about people, the importance of your voice and not being afraid to, you know, vocalize your opinion because you never know who is out there that truly needs to hear your words. And you know, who knows in the future? I just, I just know right now I'm focusing on my family and, and acting. 